to study the relation between the time of usage of car and its average annual maintenance cost the following information is obtained here the number of cars are given the types of usage of car which will be denoted as a x and the average usual maintenance cost will be y so first let's take into the book i here made the total of x column and the y to y column and here i found the x bar is 2.67 and out of the y bar information here i found 8.5 now as x bar and y bar are in decimal and not with the large value here i can show you after completing the first step for the second step here right now we didn't get the answer in integer we get in decimal now decimal also you have the two option if the value is not so, not large you can use this formula and if it is large we have to use the uv formula so this time we are going to use this formula as the value is not so large so first check what information you exactly need you have the x column and the y column the next thing you need is sigma xy so for the xy just get the multiply of this two column 3 10s are 30 1 5s are 5 2 8s are 16 2 7s are 18 14 five 13s are 65 38 are 24 and the total of this column that is sigma xy total is 154 the next thing you need is sigma x square so we'll just take the square of this column that is 3 3s are 9 1 1s are 1 2 2s are 4 4 25 and 9 and just get the total of this sigma x square will be 52 so here we have all the information which we need in formula and that is 6 there are total 6 cards so 6 sigma xy that is 154 minus sigma x that is 16 sigma y that is 51 again comes n put 6 sigma x square is 52 Minus sigma x whole square. Here we have the sixteen get square of this. So now we'll calculate six into one fifty four. We'll get nine twenty four minus sixteen into fifty one. You will get eight one six. Six into fifty two. You will get three one two. And sixteen multiply by sixteen. You will get two fifty six. Now just get them subtract. With the help of calculator, you will get one zero eight and fifty six, which comes to one point ninety three. After finding B, we'll go to find A. A is equal to y bar minus b x bar. Y bar we found in the question is eight point five minus b. Just now we found. One point ninety three x bar, that is two point sixty seven. So first of all, multiply these two value. You will get five point fifteen, and get it subtract. You will get three point thirty five. Now putting the value of b and a in the regression line of y on x. If you want, you can write down that is regression line of y on x will be for the y cap is equal to a plus b x a you found three point thirty five plus b that is one point ninety three and the for x. first go to the question and find out is any information is given obtain the regression line y on x find the estimated average annual maintenance cost when the usage time of car is 5 years also finds it error so here we'll keep x as a 5 so here 3.35 plus 1.93 multiply by 5 you will get 9.65 just get them add you will get 
for this you can write down that hence the estimate of average annual maintenance cost obtained is 30 here to find out the error first go to for the five years where the information of y where which is given average annual maintenance cost as per the question that is 13 and the y cap just now we found is 13 so for finding error first take the y cap as 13 and the y for the five years maintenance we got 13 so here will be to find out the value error y cap minus y that is 13 minus 13 is equal to 0 so hence the point 5 is on the fitted regression line for the y cap question number 3 the information for a year regarding the average rainfall and the total production of crop in turns of 5 district is given below here is the average rainfall which will be denoted as a x and the crop turns which will be denoted as a y here they say to find out the regression line of production crop on rainfall and estimate the crop of average rainfall in 35 centimeters. That is to keep for finding y cap the x value. So first of all let's take into the formula and the table and here I made the total of x and y and after removing x bar I found it 31 and y bar as 90. Where we need to find out x bar and y bar is in integer so this formula will be used. The first question which we have done in the same exercise so out of this this is what we exactly need now let's make a calculation for x minus x bar the x bar here we found is 31 x minus 31 and y minus the y bar which we found in this question is 90 so x is 25 minus 31 will get minus 6 32 minus 31 1 7 minus 2 0 for the y minus y bar 84 minus 90 will get minus 6 90 minus 90 0 95 minus 90 will be 5 minus 2 3 now exactly what we need in the formula is the multiplication of this two column 6 6 are 36 here minus minus get plus 1 0 are 0 7 5 are 35 even here minus minus get plus 2 2 is a 4 0 3 is a 0 and the total of this column that is x minus x bar and y minus y bar is 75 x minus x bar whole square the square of this column 6 6 is a 36 the minus minus will get plus 1 1 is a 1 7 7 is a 49 2 2 is a 4 0 and the total of x minus x bar whole square will get 90 now just keep into the formula sigma x minus x bar y minus y bar is 75 divided by sigma x minus x bar whole square that is 90 and here we get the answer 0.83 next step is to keep find out a formula is y bar minus b x bar y bar just now we found is 90 minus b is 0 0.83 x bar is 31 90 minus get them multiply you will get 25.73 get them minus you will get 64.27 now we'll keep the regression line y on x where we are going to find out y cap that is a plus b x a that is 64.27 plus b that is 0 0.83 and the x which is given in the question that is 35 64.27 plus now multiply this two you will get 29.05 now add them that is the regression line here we found is 93.5 32 so here we can write hence the estimate of crop obtained for the y cap is 93.32 term next question question number four the following data gives the experience of machine operators and their performance rating here are the operators are eight experience which is denoted as x performance denoted as y now here they find out till to calculate a regla regression line of performance rating in on the experience and estimate the 
performance rating of an operator having seven years of experience so let's take into the table here the total of x and y and find out the x bar is 10 and y bar is 81 in integer so here is the formula which we are going to use i just calculate and show you here i remove the calculation and the information we need for the formula here i put 247 that is the total of x minus x bar and y minus y bar and x minus x bar whole square information uh, total is 218 get it calculated you will get 1.13 the next we need is a here y bar minus b x bar y bar that is 81 which we got in the question minus b that is 1.13 from just now we solve x bar is 10 81 minus 1.13 multiplied by 10 it will be 11.3 get them minus you will get 69.7 the next is to keep regression line y on x that is y cap is equal to a plus b x a that is 69.7 plus b that is 1.13 and the x which is given in the question is for the 7 years so we'll keep 7 89.7 plus 1.13 into 7 you will get 7.91 get them add here is the answer 77.61 here we can say the estimated performance rating obtained in y cap is 77.61 moving to the next here we complete the four question from the exercise 3.1 will go next to the 